welcome to my channel it is my training today is going to start a video that is based on address list screen configured and creation in exchange server 2019 so if you like my videos please subscribe my channel and share my videos you can also connect me on my facebook page that is www.facebook.com slash it smart training so let's start the video so at first we have to know that what is an address list and what is the necessary to use uh, an address list so address list uh, are a group of recipients or email address so address list basically a group of recipients email address and why do you need it uh, suppose i have a big organization and there is a thousands of users so it is not possible to remember each and every user's email address so we can basically what to do we can basically segregate uh, some of the recipients email address based on their uh, country based on their state based on their job description uh, based on their department something like that so address list supported uh, in exchange server 2019 there is a few types of address list are supported like mailbox shared mailbox room mailbox this kind of addresses are uh, in our support inside the address list so we already covered the mailbox but uh, shared mailbox and room mailbox i didn't cover yet so we will do it very soon so next uh, it is a group of recipient based of organization department location or any other criteria so it is easier to use a fine recipient so i already told that uh, the company has employees working from two different cities say kolkata and bangalore so we want to create two different lists based on the city location or employees so we also create a custom address list to do this task so let's start the lab so go to the domain controller go to run dsa.msc to open activity views and computers here we create two separate uh, organization unit like Kolkata another one is like Bangalore okay in Kolkata I create a user K1 okay provide the password another user new user k2 and in the bangalore i create same to user named b1 provide the password so users are created so in my Kolkata user I set state or province Kolkata and in KT user do the same thing state or province is Kolkata in the Bangalore user same uh, we set the state or province Bangalore
Bangalore. Okay. So my users are created now. Uh, we have to create a mailbox from Exchange Control Panel. Go to Recipient. Create a user mailbox. We already have a user, so I just select the K1 and go to more option select the database i select the default database which is uh, created uh, the uh, installation uh, with the installation time uh, same go to the k2 same more option browse select default database save Next, use a mailbox, browse, B1, OK, more option, browse, default database, use a mailbox, browse, B2, more option, default database, done. All mailboxes, mailbox enable users are created. Now I have to create an address list go to organization select address list just plus button name Kolkata the name of the address list is Kolkata so add a rule I have to select a rule that is state or province means I said where that rule find the state or province is Kolkata that user will automatically add inside the address list we don't have to uh, manually put every user uh, inside the address list. I set a criteria which criteria is match that particular user is automatically uh, the, their email address is automatically added into the address list. Same. You have made changes address list uh, for the changes to become effective and update details pane. Okay. I have to set update. Yes close next I have to create another address list named Bangalore same set a rule state of province named Bangalore add ok save same update so updated address list now I have to go to the uh, outlook I just uh, go to the send receive and update folder one send receive and then go to the address book here you can find the Bangalore and Kolkata two address list are there uh, and sometimes you mm, you have uh, some time to reflect uh, the address list uh, in inside the address book so if I select Bangalore you can see the Bangalore user over here if I select Kolkata you can select Kolkata when I send the mail I just select a new mail okay go to the address book select Kolkata K1 just double click on it ok the K1 user is automatically add over here ok so this is how we can create uh, address book and we can add the recipient's email address inside the address book so now we are going to start another thing that is a, uh, a different thing uh, which is a we set a custom attribute and uh, and set the address book uh, from PowerShell. Okay. Now I create a user mailbox um, via Exchange PowerShell. Now I create. A user address book via 
exchange power shell or exchange management shell so to create exchange uh, uh, address book so we need a command new address hyphen list hyphen name the address list name is India recipient filtration recipient type is equals to user mailbox this is a mailbox user and uh, state province equal to Kolkata or state province equals to Bangalore uh, if any criteria is matches that particular user is mapped uh, inside the, the India address list so I just copy the command go here Just open a notepad here. It's remote connection, so that's why some problem to copying. So this is the command. Enter. See, India address list is created. get address list here you can see that India is there so I just go to the exchange control panel and just refresh here you can see India is uh, here just update close now you go to the uh, Outlook client just update a folder send receive home address book here India is not reflect yet so it's uh, need some time this need some time to update it's not yet updated I just closed it and reopen once again address book see India is there so see K1, K2, B2, B1 all are added inside the uh, India address list ok now I set a custom attribute from exchange admin center YGY so go to the recipients select any of your any of the user suppose k1 edit select click on pencil icon click general more option here is a custom attribute I said k1 is a salesperson save k2 is admin person ok similarly b1 is a sales person as well as uh, b2 is admin person ok save done
so this is how we can add uh, graphically uh, with the custom attribute now I set uh, command line using command line to set an attribute okay so I just go to the exchange admin center I just user 1 sales okay and similarly user 2 admin okay you can see I just refresh once you just go to the user 1 and you can see that the custom attribute is sets or sets which I provide in the command prompt is automatically set okay now I go to the organizations create an address list named it sales address list add a rule custom attribute one sales add okay sales address list is added I just update once see it is showing or not address book network adapter does not default gateway sales you can see three users are added ok so I now I create uh, another uh, <coughs> now I create another uh, address list via command okay I just go I just create an address list uh, which is marketing and the recipient type is mailbox and the custom attribute one is like sales okay just enter is showing some problem cannot bind parameter recipient target syntax can see that parameter is taken so I just uh, have a little mistake over here so I have to uh, set this it in inside the inverted comma okay so I set uh, all the sales named custom address book inside the marketing address list so go to the here you can see that the
the marketing address list is created go to here just close and open address book yes yes here you can see marketing so you can see that the all the marketing uh, attributes are not taking yet why it's not taking I have to update this yes update so now I just go here to address book here you can see so this is how we can create uh, address list uh, via GY and via CY thank you thank you for watching see you on next video